Why don't we just define what algae is exactly? Oh, great question. So algae is its own food category. And um, there's actually two main types of algae. One is macroalgae and the other one is microalgae. Uh, I'm going to explain what ma macroalgae is, although our conversation today is about microalgae. So macroalgae is that big stringy stuff that you see washing up on shore, also known as seaweed. And it's, and it's good for you for a, a number of reasons. It has lots of fiber and iodine because it comes from the ocean, but it has virtually no nutrition and it's only in the sea, which is why it's called seaweed. I mean, it also is called kelp or dulse, but basically it's just very fibrous um, uh, type of algae. The other algae, which is what we're talking about, is called microalgae. And it's called microalgae because it's microscopic in size. It is so tiny. You can get a million of these cells on the head of a pin. And microalgae, unlike macro, is everywhere. Macroalgae is only in the ocean. Microalgae is everywhere. It's in the lakes, the rivers, the streams, soil, your swimming pool. Uh, yes, it does close your beaches. We'll talk about why the one we're, algae we're talking about is not that algae. Uh, now, microalgae is has, uh, in complete comparison of macro, has virtually no fiber. And in fact, when it comes to spirulina, uh, it has zero fiber because it's actually not even a plant. It's a bacteria. And it, it um, compared to macro, it is the most nutrient-dense food in the world. I'm going to say that again because I know you won't believe me, but even NASA says one gram of algae has the equivalent nutrition of a thousand grams of fruits or vegetables. One to a thousand. One so micro, algae. one microalgae. One micro gram of microalgae. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Has the same nutrition as a thousand grams of fruits or vegetables. That's about 30 grocery carts of food. So it's really hard to envision, but, um, and, and that's why when, when we, we, we get into some of the detail, uh, because we sell our algae in little tablets and each tablet has the same nutrition um, as an entire plate of vegetables because of this concentrated nutrition. There is nothing in the world with more nutrition than a microalgae. And we'll, the United Nations endorses it as the answer to world hunger for that reason. It has the highest protein in the world, has three times the amount of protein at stake, has the highest chlorophyll in the world, has 500 times more chlorophyll than arugula, 25 times more than, than liquid chlorophyll. So algae uh, uh, is, microalgae is the most concentrated food in the world. And we are all getting sick for two main reasons. One is our food doesn't contain the same nutrition that it used to because our soils are so damaged. So there's no minerals in the soils for the plants to pull up. So even if you are eating vegetables and 95% of people aren't, but even if you were, you're not getting the nutrition that you used to or your grandparents did. And number two, we have too many toxins in our bodies. The average adult now has 700 toxins and our immune system simply can't sustain that. And one of the algae we're going to talk about is chlorella, pulls out the toxins. And the first algae we'll talk about is spirulina, which is very nourishing to your body, to your brain and to your mitochondria. So just to recap, <clears throat> algae, macro and micro macro good for the fiber, no nutrition, microalgae, the most concentrated food in the world. And it is a food. In fact, it was the first life on earth 4 billion years ago. And we'll, we'll dig into that. And there are tens of thousands of strains of microalgae, tens of thousands. The two we're going to talk about today are spirulina and chlorella. And they are the two that are harvested as, uh, as crops. So not from the ocean, they're harvested in fresh water. So it's food, number one, it's a whole food, not a supplement. Supplements are made from a mashup of extracts and they use high heat, which kills most of the enzymes and other nutri nutrients, not what we are selling here. We call our algae, we, call it in, we sell them in tiny tablets, we call bits, because they're bits of food that's grown in fresh water Ours is triple filtered. Um, ours, our algae is quite different from virtually anything else. And we'll talk about that in a minute. But it's grown in triple filtered spring mountain water, dried without high heat, which is a very important point we'll talk about in a minute, into a powder. And then we press them into tablets that we call bits. Uh, we call our spirulina energy bits because 
spirulina does give you energy in the moment, mental, physical, um, and also at the mitochondria level. And chlorella um, is the highest chlorophyll in the world, which pull, and it pulls out toxins, so it helps you recover your health, recover your strength, recover your body, and we call ours recovery bits. So.